He says his family is what keeps him going. Jonathan Davila has been hospitalized since late March, recovering from COVID-19. The only time he's seen his three kids in person was for a few minutes outside while he was being transferred from Elmhurst Hospital to Mary and Joy Rehab two months ago. My wife and my kids, you know, they're my, they're my life. So that's why I push on and stuff. At first, he thought it was a bad cold, but then it got worse and sent him to the emergency room. Within 24 hours, Davila was on a ventilator, unconscious for several weeks before eventually recovering well enough to breathe on his own. At Mary and Joy, he's now been relearning how to walk and other basic functions. He spends at least three hours a day in therapy. The extent of his illness is profound. Uh, he has weakness in all his limbs. So when I first met him, he could barely lift his arms off the bed. Davila's wife, Ashley, and the kids have all tested positive for COVID-19 antibodies, but none had serious symptoms and never knew they had it. That's the scariest part of this is because you just, you never know who it's going to hit. Davila says his mission now is to warn people that COVID-19 is real and wearing a mask is important even for young people. I'm young, I was healthy, and then I got it. And I got it pretty bad. After four months of being hospitalized, Davila is finally scheduled to go home next week. But doctors say he still has a lot of work to do and a long road to go before he makes a full recovery. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.